Lawmakers in Alabama say residents are paying a deadly price when it comes to the COVID-19 vaccine rollout. Four senators, including Republican Senator Jim McClendon, wrote a letter to the Alabama Department of Public Health saying the distribution process is being interrupted because the state is not following CDC rules. Josh Gant has the details. At least four state senators are taking issue with Alabama's rollout of the COVID-19 vaccine. In this letter, the senators say the state health department appears to be unable to provide information to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention necessary to get more vaccine. They want answers to four questions, including how many doses have been put into arms and how many of those doses have been reported to the CDC. Senator Jim McClendon is wanting answers. If my constituents are to be uh, considered, uh, it's not going too well. They're, they're having troubles getting phone calls through and uh, and getting the uh, vaccine and just getting the job done. McClendon, who is 78, has recovered from COVID-19 and received his vaccine this week. He says ADPH needs to account for all vaccines in the state. He says it should be a simple process. CDC says when you inject somebody with this vaccine, let us know. And if you don't let us know, we may not ship you anymore until you do catch up. That's yeah, that's pretty straightforward. ADPH firing back, telling the senators it's in constant communication with the CDC and any problems in reporting the numbers aren't affecting how many doses our state gets. Also, ADPH says the data to answer each of the questions asked in the letter is publicly available on the state's COVID-19 vaccine dashboard. 